fake friend test. If you send this to your friend and they don't respond with a video cooking kids and then eating them, that's a fake friend. Here's an example. few moments later hey kid one free candy it's very yummy okay get in the van child okay you have to go in the oven to get the candy Thousand years later. Yum tastes like oranges. Hola! Soy Dora! Can you help me find the meaning of life? Uh, that was a bit hard for a six year old to figure out. Can you help me get through an existential crisis? Are we. I don't know if we should be watching this. Yeah, I think I should turn it off. If you turn it off, I'm gonna find you. What? Turn off the TV, and you're dead. That... That doesn't seem... Should, I, we should get mom. Get your mother, and you're dead. Okay, I guess I, we should help you with the meaning of life. Great! Can you help me find my backpack? <laughs> Oopsies! What was that? Looks like we ran over another pedestrian. What should we do? I know! Backpack! Backpack, backpack! Anything that you may need, I got inside the- Wait, Neptune Toro, what the- <laughs> We accidentally flattened this man, and now we need a tool to help! Yeah, you probably got like a, a phone in here or something, right? Toro, why did you even pack all this stuff? Yay! Now we have all the tools we need to help us! Dora, we have to call the cops! If you call the cops, I'll tell them you did it! What? And who do you think they believe? The cute, innocent little girl? Or the creepy man dressed up as a backpack who follows her around? Now dig! We did it! We did it! We did it! Yay! We hit the body! I do not understand how people are not afraid of spiders. Like, it has eight legs and like 20,000 eyes. Uh -uh. I saw a spider in my room. You think I'm gonna sleep in there? And <laughs> nope, I'm moving to Japan. Konichi! Uh -huh. What? I want a bowl of chili. Okay. Oh wait, I can make it at home. Dinner is served. What is this? It's chilly. <laughs> Honey, I don't feel really well. I can hear you, but I won't. <laughs> you want your mother to die? Let me call your sister, Moana, honey. Calls me. Yes, honey, I'm calling you. I need a glass of water and my medicine. I don't. Ah! Why are you telling your sister to don't help me? What do you want? Honey, I just need my medicine, otherwise I'm gonna die. <laughs> you want me to let it go? You want me to die? You've been keeping me awake. Moana, honey! Calls me. We have to leave, honey! Your sister crazy! She's gonna kill us both! Ah! I don't know how far, honey, but just far away! Where ah! are you going? Don't leave me alone! Honey, run! She's coming! Ah! Into the unknown! <laughs> You're never gonna see us again! 
Hey man, what you watching? Oh, <laughs> I'm just watching Dora. <laughs> you still watch this show? This show's for babies. <laughs> Is that part of the show? Well, I've seen her look in the camera before. Dude, where did she go? Well, it looks like she's coming for you. I think that's her right now. Oh yeah! Soy Dora! Who's the queen here? I'm the queen. Oh queen, please help me, my daughter is going crazy. Billy, say something. Tongue bite my tongue. See, she's crazy, she keeps saying bite my tongue. Please do something, queen. Be the good girl. Billy, listen to the queen, she said be a good girl, okay? All the good girls go to hell. No, good girl, don't go to hell. Oh my gosh, she's going crazy, queen. What should I do now? Let it go. What? You want me to let my baby go? Not your baby. You are my baby. I'm your mother. Oh my god, queen, please. What should I do with her? Turn away and slap. You want me to slam my daughter? Okay, I'll do that. I'm sorry, Billy. Oh yeah, she seems fine. Ah! Bro, what? I know you ate my Chinese food. I did not eat your Chinese food. Yes, you did because I had six pieces of honey chicken, two egg rolls, and five thousand two hundred and eighty-six grains of rice. Who the hell counts the rice? Me. Come eat you. Water solves everything. If you're thirsty. Just drink water. Trying to lose weight? Just drink water. Trying to get clearer skin? Just drink water. Have a best friend that stabbed you in the back? Drown them with water. Here's an example. Here is why you shouldn't buy a dog. If you buy a dog, the dog is cute. When you look at the dog, you will love the dog. When you love the dog, you will do anything for the dog. You will give the dog your bed. When you give the dog your bed, you won't have anywhere to sleep. When you don't have anywhere to sleep, you can't sleep. When you can't sleep, you will be tired. When you're tired, you can't go to work. No work, no money. No money, no food. When you have no food, you will become very, very hungry. Then you will eat the dog. When you eat the dog, there's no more dog. When there's no more dog, you will become sad. When you become sad, you will become angry. When you become angry, you will fight someone. If you fight someone, you go to jail. And if you go to jail, you will die in jail. So don't buy dogs. I like your hair. Thank you. That's a wig. My mom be wearing those. I like your shirt. Thank you. My mama stole it from Walmart. She be boosting. Looks like we grinded up another civilian with our lawnmower. <laughs> Guess he shouldn't have stepped on my dandelions. I know what to do. Backpack! <laughs> no, I don't care what you do to me. I'm not digging any more holes. Okay. Okay? Bake them into a pie. What? Bake them into a pie. <laughs> In the oven, they will fry. Should have listened to me, don't you cry. Hurry up before the cops arrive and bake them into a pie. <laughs> Let's watch their corpse fry. Now let's give the pie to the civilian's wife. My friend made you a pie. Oh, thank you. Hi, welcome to Starbucks. What can I get you today? Come eat you.